Okay, now we are on Taurus. Okay, I feel like your sacred purpose, abundance. Okay, so that's interesting because I left off with Aries, and at the end of the reading, it was all about sacred purpose. Okay, and I felt like simple activity in flow state was going to help Aries uh, find their sense of purpose if they were questioning it. Okay, and then here it is, sacred purpose, eternal flame, and ancestral legacy. So that's what I was saying through the silence, the subtle energy within. You can uh, reach for that purpose, a deeper uh, meaning, okay, for you. And I feel like the sun transit here is helping you with abundance, fortune, wealth, and plenty. Okay, the sun is here. Hallelujah. So we have seven, Saturn, and then we have... Uh, 10 which breaks down to a one so feeling connected feeling good feeling um, yeah feeling uh, like yourself is harmonizing with the all sacred gratitude okay so another way to move out of five lower d uh, energy is to really appreciate uh, all things right some people, you know, we get so used to things, we take for granted sometimes, right? What other people in the world don't even have, right? Not everybody has uh, heaters and air conditioning and simple things like that. It's like really appreciating the things that we have. And as we appreciate those things and just... Um, what we've come into up until this point as a collective, I feel like more is flowing in that way. And affirmative prayer can also be helpful in moving this abundance. Right, and I feel like this sun transit is very beneficial. Yeah, so whatever was um, felt like conflict, that's floating away. Clairvoyance, inspiration, interpretation, and trust. Okay, so trust, I feel like, is the one that's lighting up here in this card. Okay, so inspiration going with that feeling of purpose. And, you know, everything is energy. And what we interpret in our own point in time can be different than the others. And we don't have to uh, move with the masses if we don't want to, right? In herd mentality. Okay. So whatever it is that is uh, calling within... Uh, it's also asking to trust it more, I feel like. And this could be also, if you've divorced or broken up with someone, to be open to the idea of receiving love from another again. Okay. That readiness is very key here. Because that is a sign of healing also. Oh, heal in the heart. Okay, power of self-love. Okay, so some of you um, are just going to move through this kind of self-love and picking up Scorpio energy too. It's like self-love and self-care. Okay, so in September here, coming into September, more blessings are on the way. So it's like uh, make peace with where you are and... The abundance can flow in as soon as now. I leave you with that.